Good okay. evening, Facebook land. Here we are again, the dynamic tool. If you caught those first few seconds, uh, we <laughs> had a bad connection. So welcome back. We have Peggy Wanner and Betty Shepard in beautiful Burnsville. We have a gorgeous day going today. And we are going to be cooking shish kebabs on the grill. Or as Wayne would say, Bob's on the bobby. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to go over here and put our things together. So stay with us while we, wa while we do this and we'll tell you about our recipe and what we're up to. All right. All right, so you want to switch it to... Go ahead and switch it. Okay. Switch it, just watch it doesn't fall off. Okay. So here we have Peggy and Betty putting together chicken and steak shish kebab. We're going to build these so that Wayne can do, you want to do chicken, I'll do steak. Does that work? I guess so. Doesn't matter, I guess. Oh, no, it doesn't work. I'll leave that one. <laughs> I'll put that over here. All right. So let's talk a little bit about what we have. One less steak. With our steak, steak we have, um, <clears throat> Gerardo Blake, right? We have garlic and oregano and salt and pepper. And we have olive oil and lemon juice and lime juice soy sauce in there and then in our chicken flavoring we have lemon juice lime juice olive oil we have parsley and basil and some garlic and salt and pepper too so those are our recipes for marinating our meat and then on our meat we're going to put all these fun things so Betty's going to tell you what we have here we have the onions the pineapple love the pineapple we have we have the um, tomatoes cherry tomatoes the mushrooms and the peppers, of course, we have the orange, the yellow, and the red. Okay. All right, so we're going to start by putting some together so we can get Wayne cooking on the grill. So, Betty's doing chicken, I'm doing steak. The chicken's saying, don't do me, don't just, do me, I'm just kidding. We'll just put some variety on here. So we've got steak, red pepper, we've got a mushroom going on. We're going to do a tomato here. I'm doing what she's doing, but I'm just <laughs> not saying it. And I got a pineapple going on. And we're going to put an onion on there. Because we know some of these people here love onions. Oops. What am I doing? I Orange. lost my pineapple, so we'll put them back on. A little more meat. Another piece of meat. And then I think this guy is kind of full. I should have put another piece of meat in the middle, huh? Hey, we'll get better at this as we go. <laughs> Why do we need to our paste? I'll give you another mushroom. All right. Then we're going to repeat the process. Okay, here we go, folks. Building some more. Wayne's got the grill already started, so that it'll be nice and warm when we get ready to put these on there. That should be fun. Hi, Tiffany. Oh, hey, Tiff. How are you? And Sarah, right, is on. Sarah Retz. Yeah. Hi, Sarah. Rex. How are you, Sarah? The one thing about doing this, Peggy, <laughs> is it makes you hungry because you smell all It the... does, because it smells great. The yeah, marinating is wonderful. <laughs> Another piece of meat here. So we can get these, get these men with some meat in their bellies, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I think that's the moment we don't care. We're just like, oh, we love the grilled fish. Yeah. So, so, so Mediterranean again. Um, Show me the beef. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Where's the beef? <laughs> Show me the beef. <laughs> so this is kind of fun. It's a beautiful day out here in Burnsville, so we are cooking outside, taking advantage of it, because as we all know, we're not that far away from things changing for weather in yes. this part of the country. <laughs> All right, another piece of meat on here. What are you doing on yours, Betty? Give us a little rundown, will you? Oh my gosh, I got the chicken, I got the onions, I got the uh, pineapple, mushroom, chicken, cherry tomato. I am now going to put on the little uh, orange pepper in one meat, and then we'll be done. Okay. <laughs> Just for fun. We're separating so you can see it. Yeah, yeah they might be. Oh, I'm oh. sorry. Didn't Actually, mean to I, hurt think you. <laughs> I think we should turn them around. So again, we'll tell you a little bit about our marinade. In the, uh, the beef marinade, we've got soy sauce, garlic, olive oil, um, oregano, salt and pepper, and lemon and lime juice. So we've got a nice variety in there. And in the chicken one, we have lemon and lime juice, olive oil, oregano, and parsley, oh, and salt and pepper. 
So we should have some great flavors here. We'll be putting on the grill before long. Maybe we'll get Wayne started here with some cooking in just a little bit. I think we need a pineapple yet. This is kind of fun. And a hunk of meat. No, I, yeah, I keep forgetting. You men are the meat eaters. <laughs> All right, let's get another piece of meat on there. I just like putting them together, we'll guys. <laughs> I was like, oh, it's simply lying here. Let's do this. Yeah. And you know it doesn't take that long. So if you out there in Facebook land have made shish kebabs before, drop a one below. If this is new for you and you're watching and learning, drop a two below. And if anybody would be kind enough to share the button down in the lower left corner, we would love that. I'll let some people see what we're doing on the grill, how easy and fun it is to put these together. It really doesn't take a lot of work at all. We did pre-chop our stuff so that we wouldn't bore you to death with all the chopping, but um, you know, just cutting things as evenly sized as you I can. I got the last one. So that they cook more evenly. Uh -huh. That way hopefully your meat is done when your vegetables are done and all of that. It's a perfect night for this. Yeah, it's so gorgeous out tonight. So, I would like to know out there in Facebook land who all saw that great um, Facebook live we did last week, upside down. <laughs> Parts of it were upside down. Do so, you know? It was kind of neat. Uh oh, I the didn't camera fell out of the holder. Right. We accidentally flipped it upside down then when we picked it up. And then it ran that way for a little while. Yep. And then we didn't realize Look what it. I just did. Oh my mind. Just don't do what Betty just did. Yeah. Flipped it straight once and flipped it upside down again. So at the end, it was pretty funny. But I think we'll let Wayne get started with cooking. So I'll take the camera and we'll show you what he's going to do. All right. So here we have the grill. Hi, Tiffany. Hi, Sarah. How's everybody today? Are you guys enjoying this gorgeous day? All right. So we're lighting the grill. You may want to do something. I may have changed tanks. Uh oh. <laughs> Well, you know, that's re that's reality. That's being authentic. So, might take a minute here. All right, so let's take a look at what we have here. Give me a minute. Always got another tank. Yep, Wayne's prepared. So how does that look, folks? Doesn't that look delicious? So we have chicken and steak kebabs. We'll kind of show you. So here we are. Yeah, outside at the Wanners. And we are grilling. So it looks like fun times. Um, Wayne went to get another propane tank, so there we go, our first glitch of the day, but hang with us, he's going to be here in just a second. I think uh, we started the grill, we got it nice and warmed up, and it must have ran out in the midst of that, <laughs> so pretty funny. Huh? Sometimes life throws us those little, um, little challenges, but hey, we're prepared. Um, What's everybody doing today? Has anybody been outside enjoying the great weather? It's kind of actually cooler for this time of the year than what we normally would expect, but this is all right too. It's not too hot, not too cold. You can really just enjoy some gorgeous days. All right, we're hooking up the other tank. As the one NASCAR, but we'll get her done. <laughs> as the one ran out while we were warming up the grill, so. <clears throat> Here we go. Start up that grill. And then with our um, meal tonight, Betty has made a delicious salad for us. Maybe Betty will tell us what she's put in her salad while we're talking about this and Wayne's getting the grill oh, going. sure. Of course we have the regular, um, uh, the lettuce, lettuce, the head lettuce. Yep. And then we will have black olives. Okay. We also have a red onion, we have cucumbers, we have cherry tomatoes, we have um, shredded carrots. Okay. And then Hi, Rhonda. we have all our different desserts. And did I say cucumber? Did Miss I you too. Because I almost did. I almost did. But, um, and we just tossed that all together and that made our top salad. Awesome. That? that sounds very delicious. And Wayne, Rhonda says hi. 
Hey, Rhonda, Rhonda how are you today? <laughs> Tonight or whenever? It's been a long time. <laughs> Miss yes. you, girl. How's that little one? She's such a doll. <coughs> She's growing up too fast, though, isn't she? Gosh. All right, so here we go. Wayne's getting ready to put these shish kebabs on the grill. Now we're going to be making the shish kebabs two different ways. One on the grill and, on, and one on uh, new grill pads <laughs> that you put on there to avoid burning and stuff. Awesome. So we've got it on there and we're going to get her going. Hi, Farah. Papa, you need to say hi to Farah. She's watching. Hi, Farah. How are you? <laughs> hey, Glow. How are you? It's been a few weeks. How are you doing on your bio cell? Oh, your little cutie's out riding her bike. <laughs> Still got the training wheels or no training wheels? <laughs> oh. All right, look at this grill. So, isn't that looking delicious? So what what kind of mat is it that you're cooking on, Wayne? Is it? It's one of the new mats out that uh, that is. It's like a silicone type mat. Uh, we purchased them uh, at one of the local uh, WalMarts, and and uh, we've used it a couple times. Works fantastic. Helps yeah. keep stuff from burning. Uh, helps keep uh, the foods that normally f will fall off and fall through the grill on the grill. So. We're just going to keep an eye on it, going to shut the lid and let this cook a little bit. All right, so we're going to move over here. So come along with us. Try not to make you dizzy. Betty and I are going over here. And we're going to show you what we have out here. So since it's such a gorgeous day, we've got everything outside tonight. This is kind of nice. I hate to see this weather ever go away. But we're going to start with our... Oops. Well, let me get a hold of this camera. Faithful for fear, you can do it. Once you see the results, it becomes an addiction, and that's really true with our M3 pledge. The M3 pledge is a 90-day pledge that you take in order to get your body well and to lose the weight if that's what you so desire. We're going to have Peggy tell you about <clears throat> the first young man. All right. So these are people who've been doing the M3 program. So we're going to show you some pictures here to show you mm -hmm. the amazing results that they've had. So this gentleman you can see day one, look where he started. Only 16 days later, so barely over two weeks later, he's starting to look really good. And look at it, 40 days, how great he's looking. And then to tell you that not only does it work great for men, but it also works great for women. Yes, so look at this young lady. Yes. Betty's going to tell you about her. Yes, if you notice, you know we all seem to be getting that, what I call the midriff. <laughs> that bulge yep. and so if you do have a little problem with that as you can see on her um, beginning that she it was quite out it, you can really notice it that it's quite mm -hmm. out and then as you see the second the after mm -hmm. that she is toned <clears throat> and uh, you don't see all of the I don't want to say gut but yeah. you know yeah well, that's you can basically see that. what it and is and we'll go to the next video. all right here's another gentleman and look at this gentleman. Whoops, let me get to the right picture. Look at this gentleman. Oh this is a front view. Mm -hmm. So he is, you can see those numbers. On the left, he's day one. And only 14 days later, two weeks. Look at the difference he's got going on there. And then he's got a side view here. Again, mm -hmm. we've got day one and day 14. But you can see what an amazing difference in only two weeks. So the best thing I can say to that is, you know what, folks? Two weeks is going to go by whether or not we do anything. That's true. So why not be uh, losing some inches and losing some, releasing some pounds, losing some pounds. It's a great right. thing. With the next picture that you see here, what I really like about this, of course, yes, she is getting rid of the um, midriff, but she's also, as you can see, she had love handles, and the love handles has disappeared, and she's really getting toned. She's getting her waist back. She's looking really good. She had the start date of March 9th. And by June 11th of 2017, as you can see, the results are amazing. They yeah. really are. Looking really good. Yeah, and awesome. this is with all the, uh, the M3 pledge of the 90 days. <clears throat> but as you can see, some of them, you can see that, um, well, we'll talk about that later. Okay. That's okay, with the next picture down below. And mm -hmm. this one is one of our amazing clients that Betty's going to tell you about. Yes, this is one of our special clients. We know her very well, and 
it's just amazing the transformation that she's done. As you can see over um, the on left. this on the left. Oh, oh right, I'm sorry. <laughs> I thought you were going to okay. that one. No, over on the right, um, right. as you can see, um, we want to show you that even in your facial appearance, the difference. As you can see, uh, with the weight, it was in her face as well. And as you see on the um, left. Her face has slimmed down. She is who she was before she ever gained all that weight. She's a beautiful person. So look at that. She's so beautiful look. either way, but yeah. look at the change. Isn't that amazing? It really is. It's almost She's like gorgeous. you're seeing two different people in yeah. a way. You know? It's hard to believe. It is. It's, it really yeah, is. It's an amazing result. Yes, and is. then Betty actually knows this person personally. So let me give you kind of a long view of the picture oh, here okay. if you can, yeah. but we'll do them individually then. So right. at the top, at the top we had when she first started, she has a two-year baby fat that she could not get rid of of uh, doing different things. And the one thing that was really great about this is the product that she used. Now we know that most of the rest of them, they had the M3 and the trim as we call it. She started on the trim first because she had not yet gotten to the M3. She had her, I'm sorry, her M3 had not been delivered. And so she started on the trim. So this is the first day. Okay. This is when she, this is what she looked like. Okay. This is in her first week. Wow. As you can Look see. At the difference. And then I would say about a week and a half after that, Look at she that. then went into uh, with strictly the trim. Yeah. She totally lost. She has no more um, love. We call them love, love handles. handles. Yeah. And she doesn't have her baby fat. And she actually wrote me and and said uh, she sent me a, a what do you call it a text a Facebook yeah. text. <coughs> and she actually posted and said that she got her life back. And she really didn't believe Aww. that she was ever going to lose all that baby fat That's awesome. and get back to what she was. All right. From there, we're going to tell you a little bit about each product. First of all, we're going to show you our dynamic duo sign. Woohoo! Woo it's, it's got the O. And those yes. of you who have been watching in past weeks, we lost our O. But Wayne found us an O. Actually, he found us a whole new duo, mm -hmm. the word duo. So that was pretty great. But the program is called... Take three, do three, four threes. So the four three would be for three months or 90 days. So what we have is three products here. And actually this whole program is based on the Mediterranean diet. So the neat part is you get to eat food. A lot of the weight loss right. programs out there, you don't eat much food and you're hungry and you're starving. And that's what we love about this program. You get to eat food. You get to eat healthy food, but you get to eat food. So the first product is Burn. Mm -hmm. And Burn is... Um, a capsule so it's kind of we call it um, our gold because <laughs> it's kind of a gold color but you can take three capsules a day and you take them in the morning when you start your day and when you first start the program you might want to do one or two to see how you feel and then move it up to three mm -hmm. I love them they give me energy they get me burning fat and I wouldn't want to be without them because they are very very um, very very good at what they do Betty's going to tell you about this one, Sustain. Sustain. We love this because you take it like in mid-afternoon or afternoon. And what it is, is a vanilla or spice. We have two flavors, vanilla and spice. It's a protein shake. What it does is it curbs the appetite. Um, it also... Oh, I just lost my thing. Okay, it's also a pea-derived protein. So um, mm -hmm. that's, that's one of the better um, proteins that you can have out there. And uh, I love it because it's very easy. You can use <coughs> almond milk, chocolate, or vanilla. You can also use just water. You can use um, the coconut milk. Mm -hmm. And I left one out, but that's okay. That's, okay. that's enough. <laughs> or you could throw fruits or anything you really yes. like in it to kind of jazz it up a little and do what you like. Then our third product is called Sink, and that is actually chocolate flavored. So Sink is an evening product. It's for digestion. It optimizes digestion and lessens the late night cravings. So you'd want to do this instead of, you know, running for that candy bar or piece of cake or something like that. Um, it has a unique blend of filling plant fibers, soluble fibers from the acai tree and beta-glucans from the oat brand support the removal of dietary fats from the body. Insoluble fibers from apple and peas nurture good gut bacteria and purify your digestive tract. So we all need some of that. There aren't a lot of people out there that don't have some type of digestive issues. When combined in sync, these ingredients effectively promote digestive health and weight management. So, um, but along with that, we have, we're going to show you this little picture. We have actually five things that we recommend right. you do. Well, not, you don't necessarily have to do all five, but we recommend you pick three out of these five. Mm -hmm. 
So Betty's going to tell you about the first one. The first one is very simple. You drink water, you know, you can drink five stuff. glasses a day. A lot of people drink more than that. It's up to you, but they recommend five glasses a day. That is to keep you hydrated. And how many ounces would you do? We would only have to do 12 ounces of, the, you know, each one, each glass is 12 oh. ounces. Well, that shouldn't be too hard. No, I don't think so. I think that works. I, it would be a surprise <laughs> how much fluid we drink yeah. in a day. Uh, the next thing would be taking out the sugary drinks. So uh, if we, we'd be surprised if anyone's doing sugary drinks at how much that actually adds to our weight gain over time. Um, how are the kebabs doing, Wayne? They're progressing nicely if you want to take a quick shot. Let's take a quick look and then we'll come back over here for a couple things. Who's that? Wayne, who's that? Nope. Smells good. Yeah, it is. <laughs> All right, let's see how the kebabs are doing. Oh, wow, oh, those are like looking that. delicious. Oh, look yeah. at that, folks. Chicken and steak kebabs. And there's one thing that the ladies don't know, that if something falls off the kebabs, comes property of the cook. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Did you see that pineapple disappear? Yep, went right down that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hi, Kathy. How are you doing? Good to see you. All right, let's go back over here and finish. We just kind of wanted to see how that, how those kebabs were looking. So we have, um, we have three more things out of the five that we want to tell you about. So again, so, pick three out of the five. Right, and the third one would be don't eat fried foods. And that one for me, I thought was really going to be hard because of course, I loved fried foods, but it wasn't mm -hmm. that, it was very simple. It really was. And once you stop eating the fried foods, you do notice, and it's very hard for you to eat fried foods, whether it's chicken or fries. And the next one is take out the white stuff. Mm -hmm. So little do we know that we often gain weight very easily from white stuff like flour, rice, sugar. So right. those can be harder ones to take out, but the more you take out, the better off you are. And the one that got me going after that, the last one was I walked. Oh my gosh, walking. I learned how to walk again, you guys. And awesome. we enjoy walking the lake, we enjoy walking our neighborhood. And it's, they recommend you do 7,500 steps, and I thought that will never happen, but it doesn't. It's very comfortable, it's very easy to do once you get into the rhythm of walking. And is that per day or how, per day. how, how would per you day. do that? Okay. Per day. Very good. So, and if you really want to push yourself, you know, you can certainly do more than that. Right. Three is recommended. Four or five is even better. Mm -hmm. And just to note, there are lots of people who are doing this without actually doing any of those things at all. Right. So it is possible to still lose inches and pounds, which is a great thing. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> Got a little bit of a cold here. Anyway, we so? wanted to tell you also about our BioCell. So BioCell, <laughs> this is, um, well, I gotta, that's not good. Okay, let's do this. BioCell actually comes in <clears throat> four different types. So the Pure has Stevia in it. Right. And that one is more for people who don't want to take in a lot of sugar. It has a few less calories. And you take that one twice a day with um, <clears throat> two ounces at a time. And then the other ones, you want to tell us about the those, The other ones, Betty? we have the Sport, which of course is um, for those who are very active and, um, uh, and athletic, as well as I would like to say that it is, um, you don't have to worry about if you're taking the Sport, that for those of you who actually compete, you know, mm -hmm. you do competitions, you don't have to worry about if you're going to qualify or not because there are no drugs or related things too, drugs that would stop you from doing that. It's certified. Mm -hmm. Then we also have life mm -hmm. and life is <clears throat> basically for those people who life in general, you may not be someone who's working out a lot and you're not involved in sports and you know we're doing our daily thing, we're working, we're moms, we're you know running errands and life is just crazy and busy and it's very good for you. Um, skin is the oh, other one. Skin, so I love the skin. Betty loves the that skin one. The skin is because for all of us who are kind of getting to that age, you know, we're kind of trying to we're trying to do the anti-aging where we're not aging in our skin, we're not um, drying. Um, what is it called? They, um, oh, you lose a lot of the collagen. Okay, right. as yep. as you get older. So when you're losing a lot of the collagen, that we want to be putting that skin. back into our body instead of putting artificial things on our face to help look younger and our skin look beautiful. We need to be putting in the biocell, the collagen. We need to be also putting in the hyaluronic acid because all of this we lose as we, as we age. And so what I would suggest to you is that you should 
go and check out our mm -hmm. bio cell, you know, our liquid bio cell. And as she said, we have so many different ones, so it meets every lifestyle. Right. I am very satisfied with it, as I can tell yes. that it is toning up my skin, but my skin is also looking youthful and it, mm -hmm. the wrinkles aren't wrinkling anymore. <clears throat> And so um, check us out. As you see from this picture, it shows you that it kind of it will rehydrate your joints. <coughs> it also does many, many other great things. It's good for your skin. It's good for your nails. It's good for your hair. gums. It's good for your hair. We have people who are just ecstatic about how their hair is growing faster, their nails are growing, and they're just healthy all around far more than they were before they started taking it. So it's a great, great product. Then another little thing we want to tell you about is, we'll kind of show you those Tria. over here. We have an energy drink called Tria. So this one is actually has stevia in it and it's a little bit lower calorie. So it has zero sugar and 80 natural milligrams of caffeine. And these are very healthy. There are no bad chemicals in them. You won't... Uh, find bad chemicals like you would at maybe some of the energy drinks that you're picking up at the grocery store, the gas station, things that we do on the run or just to keep us going in right. a day. and you won't crash after you take it after a couple hours or more. You won't feel like you're crashing or you're tired or anything like that. And you only have to take one can a day, by the way. And this so one is the regular one. So this one has 110 calories and 110 milligrams of natural caffeine. Right. Um, so they are pretty amazing. Actually, one of those a day does amazing things for you. Just boosts your energy and keeps you going and they are pretty good. And tasty too. Very tasty. The um that's the melon. The melon is the one with the stevia. And, the and this one is the citrus right. with the regular sugar flavoring in it. And did we talk about trim? Let's maybe give a little more detail on trim. I don't have my trim bottle look. out here but here's the box. Oh, kind of more a little bit about how you take it and what it's like, I guess. Trim tastes like lemon meringue. I want to put that out there right away. You only have to take one tablespoon a day. And I did say that right, ladies. One tablespoon a day. Yes. And it would take the fat away. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Yeah, it's no. good. You got a little rhyme there going. <laughs> okay, this also has our collagen in it. And it does inhibit the fat absorption. It improves muscle tone. Yeah. And it restores your youthful skin. And you know the thing about the uh, in inhibited the fat absorption, what it does is it actually reduces the fat that comes out of our fat cells because we all have fat cells. Mm -hmm. So, And it nice. includes one daily serving of our bio cell. Yes. So if you purchase this and you purchase the bio cell, you only need to do one serving a day of bio cell. So bio cell is typically done twice a day. Mm -hmm. Or if you're doing trim, do you trim in the morning when you do your burn capsules? Yes and then your bio cell in the evening. Otherwise, you do bio cell both morning and evening, about 12 hours apart. So, amazing products. If anyone out there is interested in more detail on these, please send us a, a private message, and we will be happy to uh, send you some information. So let's so go, go see how the griller is yes. doing over here. Here's Carl. He's just waiting. He's <laughs> hungry, hungry. Can't wait to have some shish kebabs. That's right. <laughs> Check it out. All right. Let's look. Okay, let's see how we're doing here, guys. Oh, those are oh, looking we're good. real close to eating. We're close oh, to eating. Yeah. Okay. Maybe we'll... How do they look, Betty? <laughs> they look like they're... I'm ready to eat. They're looking good, yeah. <laughs> let's really get a little are. closer. They All right, do. look at this, guys. See the sizzle and see the mat that they're cooking yeah, on? Yeah. It's really yeah, kind of cool. I like that mat. Yeah, it works well. I don't know how sensitive the sound is on that uh, camera phone, but... I just heard sizzle? Betty's stomach growl. Oh, snap. No, it's the sizzle I can hear. <laughs> it probably did. I wouldn't doubt it. So <laughs> we I actually have it. two two great taste testers here. Oops. Oopsie. Uh-oh. The griller gets that one, too? Yep, I do. <laughs> three oh, second you know, rule. he says everything that drops, the griller gets to eat. Yep. So three second rule. Don't tell anybody, but I think he threw that one on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do too. It might have been prearranged. <laughs> <laughs> All right, maybe Betty's gonna Betty's gonna run and get the salad. So thank you for that, Betty. And we are uh, getting ready here to sit down and do some taste testing of these fine, fine kebabs that we have made. So we'll make a little room on our table from when we were setting them up. We have our veggie trays here. So again, we could tell you a little bit about what we have on them. We have steak and chicken kebabs. And then we have added onion, pineapple, tomatoes, mushrooms. And we have the three colors of peppers. We have the orange, the yellow, and the red. So we have quite a variety here. 
and we're anxious to try these. And they are in marinated, um, in Mediterranean marinades. So the beef, let me flip this camera a little bit. So the beef actually has um, soy sauce in it. We'll look at the beef over here. Beef has soy sauce in it, and then it has lemon and lime and oregano and salt and pepper and garlic in it. And the chicken has lemon, lime, oh, also olive oil in both of them. So olive oil in both of them, parsley, salt, and pepper, and pineapple juice in there as well. I forgot to mention that one earlier. So I used some of the pineapple from the pineapples into the chicken marinade, which should help sweeten it up a little bit. So here we have our fine salad that Betty has made. So I'm going to show you that. It's looking really good. Look at that. Beautiful salad. How long before we're ready for those kebabs, Wayne? I'm taking get, them off right taking now. Taking them off now? Okay. Just doing a little finish work. Carl, do you want to jump at the table here? And okay. Any seat is fine. Here's one. Do you want to jump in there? Yeah, I'll jump in there. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Okay. Carl's hungry. He told us he was hungry when he came. That's right. So we've been making him sit here and just kind of watch and drool, you know. <laughs> they are looking pretty good, so it'll be fun to see how they taste. Let's hope this Mediterranean recipe is a good one. And oh, also, by the way, Here's we... Here's the first batch. Okay. <clears throat> Oops. Do you want... Oh, baby. Look at that. Oh, look wow. That. Don't those look good? Yes. All right. Do you Steak want... or chicken? Or give them one of each. Yeah. We want to see what they think, so <laughs> try them steak. both, huh? This is the steak. And maybe when we sit down, I know Carl likes like. to do the prayer. Do we want to have him yes. do the prayer? Oh, yeah. We yeah. shall do that. Hey, no. Can we use this? Yeah, that's perfect. Thank you. I forgot about that. All right. Carl, so. if you'd lead us off, please. Okay. All right. Here we go. Dear Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for this food that we're about to receive. Bless it. And make in Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Thank you. Amen. Hey, Brandon, how are you? Hey, we are cooking shish kebabs on the grill. Maybe when you come in September, we could do that again if it's warm enough out. Hope you're doing well. We can't wait to see you in a month or so. <clears throat> Your sisters are dying to see you. You know, they haven't seen you in at least a couple, two, three years. We've um, we've been fortunate enough to see you once a year, but I know oh, they haven't, so good. they can't wait. Mm -hmm. Send some this way, huh? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Can I pack these in dry ice and get them to you? <laughs> we can sure try. Hi, Alan. How are you? Good to see you on here. So, Carl is taste testing our shish kebabs that we made on the grill. Mm -hmm. We have steak and we have chicken. You want to go ahead? You still got some on? I've got a couple on. You guys sit around. Betty, you want to start? Go ahead. Jump yeah. in. As soon as you get a kebab empty, give it to me. I'm going to load her up again. All right. I'm going to sit over here. Oh, you're filling them more? Okay. I'm cheating. I'm putting just meat on. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, let's see what you got going over here. Look at the look at the grill cook. He's just cooking some meat for himself. Uh -huh. Yep, yep. <laughs> that bigger is right. You can throw some chicken on there, too. Okay, you do the chicken. I'm going to steak. Yeah. The other one's steak. It's good. Oh, my gosh, this is good. So what are we thinking? Any comments oh. here, you guys? Oh, this is good. Is it good? You guys should be here. <laughs> mm -hmm. So Betty's tasting now as well. So can you taste the different flavors? The lemon, the lime? Yes. The garlic. Mm -hmm. The steak mm -hmm. has soy sauce in it. The chicken has some pineapple juice in it as well. Is that coming through as a flavor, anybody? Mm -hmm. I haven't tried that yet. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hold on. How is the meat? Is it tender? Or? Yes, it is. Okay, mm -hmm. good to I know. So gone. let's get our salad going, huh? We got go. we got this beautiful salad that Ooh. Betty made. I can really taste the chicken. I'll give you these. There you go. That's and um, we aren't Don't necessarily as this. good at doing the Mediterranean dressing, so we're just doing the typicals. You know, Thousand Island, you honey bowls. mustard, blue, blue cheese, <laughs> all those good things. So we've cheated a little bit there, but we are eating very healthy and... Probably about 90% Mediterranean. Right. So, um, good healthy meal here. And for dessert, we're actually going to do just some pears. Um, Mediterranean diet recommends doing fruit. And so we are not doing the um, high calorie, you know, cakes, pies, those types of things. So, staying on the healthy side of life. So, pears will be our dessert. We also have black olives. 
Brandon, we know you love black olives. You like some of those? <laughs> He's like, yeah, All right. I'll put them through the phone, right? Okay, Peggy, you better sit down and get yourself something to eat. All righty. I'll be there um, in a minute or two. And the blue cheese? Should we? Oh, I have to have some Yeah. Okay. All right, folks, we are one second here. We're close to everybody closing out. So we want to say thank <laughs> you. I'm sorry. <laughs> thank you. Thank you to Carl for our taste testing. Yes. Oh, I just thanks. love it. <laughs> That's Anytime. good. Anytime. All right. <laughs> you wouldn't mind coming back again? Well, if you don't right. cook like this, I'll be here every day. All right. <laughs> and thank you to our grill master, Yay. Wayne. We appreciate all the good grilling you do. Yeah, I'm just you cheating do. now. I'm just putting odds and ends on there. All right. Let me switch this around. Okay. All right, so with that, folks, here we have Betty and Peggy again, and we want to say everyone's journey is different. Smiles are contagious. Kindness is always free. And you only fail if you quit. Have a blessed week. Bye-bye. Thank you for joining us. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.